you're meant to lead, you have to learn what it's like to lose men. To have them die trusting you. And there's only one way to learn that lesson. First time I did was on D-Day. All right, lads, listen up. We've got until dawn to achieve our objective. And it seems like the crowds already know we're coming. Now we've got one chance to demolish the coastal artillery. But if we don't, the invasion tomorrow will fail. Now I trained you all for this. Let's not let the Navy show us up. So take the case, mates. Blast the artillery and fire your flares to let the Navy know the job's done. All right, this is it. You know the drill. Stand up! Hook in! Stand by! See you on the ground!
you Kingsley we picked you as a crowd lucky we didn't fill you full of lead nice to see you gents where do we stand the captain didn't make it so we're on our own now I say we dig in and wait for the rest of the sick airborne to assemble Henry said we had till dawn to destroy the artillery if we don't the invasion fails so you fancy yourself the captain now? Sun-up's an hour away at best. There's no time for a sit-down. Yeah, there's also no muscle and no cavalry coming to save the bloody day. The only thing we can do here is to die or try not hey, to. you two scrapping nobles got the bigger bollocks ain't gonna solve nothing. Those German casemates aren't that far away. I think we can get to them in time. So I say we take them out. The company's scattered. We're pissing in the wind at this point. You know what's at stake. You all do. This is madness. Hey, we're beyond madness. Look, I'm with Arthur. We finished the mission. All right, Kingsley. 
Looks like you're in charge now. Casemates and Valhalla are that way. We should get moving. What's the plan, Kingsley? Let's get a path cleared. You heard the Sarge. Clear that debris. was a mess from the up. Hey, Sarge showed up right in the nick of time. Saved our skins, he did. Getting about three full of light, Kate. Lucky for him. <sighs> Those lights on the cliff. That's the coastal defense battery. The bridge is well guarded and the bank's too steep. We secure the bridge then. It's our only move. You're the boss. Sarge. At the fence. Take them out. On them on the truck!
Strike MG! Let's move it. Everyone on that transport. Well, that was a fucking kerfuffle. <laughs> hey, Sarge got it done. We're still here, aren't we? I suppose. Eight men standing against the Nazi gun fort. Richard said I'd gone mad. Sometimes, a little madness is called for. I think deep down he understood that, and realized we were cut from the same cloth. This way. Surrounded by ditches as well. Yeah. So like, yeah, we, we've got to take that into account. Yeah, I suppose so. Look at those defences. Bloody hell. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. They're waiting at the table up here. How's it looking, Sergeant? Let's see for yourself. Let's get you the lay of the land. Our targets are the guns housed in those casemates. And we can only get there through a horde of Germans armed to the teeth. Think you can handle taking out the lower gun? I fancy my chances. That bunker's our way in, but it's packed with MGs. It'll be a hard push. First job's getting across that minefield. But that anti-tank ditch could be useful. I've got an idea. I'm all ears. We can punch a hole through the mines with those blitzers there. And the bunker will make minced meat out of us as soon as they hear the engines coming. We're going quiet then. No engines. Bail at the last second, let gravity do the work. 
I should get us to the ditch at least. Well, I love it. I think you should go first. <laughs> All right then. As soon as you hit the ditch, get the men ready. Tommy, you with me? Oh yeah. Drive through the minefield, take the bunker, strap some thermite to some highly explosive weapons. Piece of piss, Sarge. And you, get a second sun burning in the sky. If our ships don't see that flare, if they don't know we've won, they'll fire on the guns and risk taking us with them. Well, I don't know about you, but I think I'll take very little consolation in knowing that the fire that killed me was friendly. Don't worry, Gov. I won't forget to aim up. Godspeed, Kingsley. Case mates, I'll take the upper ones. Don't forget the flare. Let's move up. All right, Sarge. All right, boys, this is it. You're on me. Tommy! Try and get back. We need to clear the door. All right, lads. Half of you. With me. That hot track's carrying us up. Suppressive fire now. Take out that hot track. Track now. Track 
gunner is down. Seven. Torch over here! down, one to go. That's the last of the thermite. Sarge, I could use your help here. Sergeant. 
Stairs. Grenade! Get down! Sounds like Webb did his part. The rest is up to us. Shit! Take cover! Smoke ready! Clear him out! Smoke up! Go! <laughs> Case made is clear. How are we blasting this one? We're out of thermite. I'll feed it a Bangalore. Let's get up top before this thing explodes. You have the flare, Sarge? Bombardment's close. Go! Get out and fire the flare! <laughs> Sergeant, the flare! Bombardment's any minute! Damn! Flare's ruptured! You've got to be fucking joking! Where's Webb? There! Lower case, mate! Incoming! Get down! I'm going for Webb's flare! Get everyone to cover! We need to run for it! Time to take a kip. I was just waiting for some mad bastard to come and save the day. Well, let's you and I signal our boy, shall we? We'd lost our captain, but we'd won the day. And we'd honored the memory of all those we lost the only way we could by completing the mission. You look at the soldiers under your command and hope that they can do the difficult thing, the impossible thing. That flare told me I'd been right. This is what it means to be a leader. <laughs>